Tory Lanez has been remanded back into the custody of the L.A. County Jail. That's right. This Montana White with Meta Drugs, Hip Hop, Money, Power, and Politics. And you are now in the Meta Drug Zone. Go ahead and hit that subscribe button because Tory Lane, he, uh, he went to court this morning and they locked him back up. And this goes to show you that celebrity does not equal power in this country you feel what i'm talking about now tory lanes went to court of course for the case he got where he supposedly allegedly shot meg the stallion in the foot and they've been hopping around this subject and going back and forth on twitter but when he went to court this morning the judge remanded him and told him his other bill was revoked and he got to come up with another three hundred and fifty thousand dollars because he violated the contact order right and it seems that he was sending messages to meg the stallion through twitter and the judge said it seems to be clear messages to meg and he added that uh uh in the future once he gets out on this one not to mention her again in this post now i don't care i don't care i i personally i don't care this some internet news and i'm just You know, I'm rolling up one and I'm just thinking about it. Now, I'm not thinking about what he did. I'm thinking about why he got his bail revoked. Because he was on Twitter. Because now, the man, the men in this world, right? They cannot control their emotions without grabbing their phone, jumping on a social media platform, and telling all their business. Like... When did this happen? I know when it happened. It happened when smartphones were invented because before smartphones, men couldn't run out and publicly just tell everything that they knew or did in a certain situation. You had people close to you that you talked to and they might have spread it, but you did not go outside with a megaphone and say the things that people say on Twitter. Now, this tweet, those tweets have cost him another 350000 350, $350,000. Yeah, I said it right just then. Slow down. Now, which isn't a problem, but in the court of popular opinion, you know, where does this leave Tory Lanez? Well, I don't know because I'm not really a fan and, you know, I don't watch Meg Thee Stallion videos either because uh, I heard they had transsexual men in her videos dressed like women. So I don't, I don't even try to figure out who's a man and who's not. You feel what I'm saying? So I just kick back, relax. I know Meg Thee Stallion is a hell of a rapper and Toy's a hell of a rapper slash R&B singer. You feel what I'm talking about? And if this was for publicity, they doing a hell of a job. And we caught up in the Matrix and you are listening to this in the metaverse. So guess what? I'm at the strip club tonight where you can touch it and feel it in real life. Y'all follow me on Instagram at MontanaWhite100 and subscribe right now because uh, Toy Lane should be out by now. He's going to have to have counsel with his lawyer so his lawyer can explain to him why going to social media is not in his benefit and, uh, you know, get money. Stay out the way. I'm out.